Good morning. My name is Corinne Richard and I'm a grade 9 chaplaincy student here at All Saints. Today I'll be leading us in morning prayer. Today is the third day in the week of prayer for Christian unity. Today's theme is praying together. In Christ, God came to meet us. Jesus lived in prayer, immediately united to his Father. While creating friendships with his disciples and all those he met, he introduced them to that which was most precious to him, the relationship of love with his Father, who is our Father. In today's verse, we learn that Jesus wants us to know him, and through him, his Father, because he considers us to be his friends. Today's verse says, I do not call you servants any longer. I have called you friends. Prayer can be on our own or shared with others. It can express wonder, complaint, intercession, which is asking for what we need, thanksgiving, or simple silence. Sometimes we are not sure what is the best way to pray. Turning to Jesus and saying to him, teach me, can pave the way. Let us pray. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, Amen. Lord Jesus, your entire life was prayer, perfect harmony, with the Father. Through your Spirit, teach us to, to pray according to your will of love. May the faithful of the whole world unite in intercession and praise. And may your kingdom of love come as we pray together. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. All saints pray for us. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen.